palm reading with comparison. People who are learning palmistry may find this video useful. It's only when you compare two hands, only then you'll be able to distinguish between two different palms. Lastly, the practical aspect to the palm reading and analysis is explained in this particular video. Uh, I would just end out here. I would just close one slide out here and just show another one. Press the bell icon on YouTube and don't miss another update. To get a palm reading from me, you can call me or you can email me. These are the phone number and the email that are mentioned out here. So in this particular palm video, we would be talking and comparing about two different hands out here. One is of a famous cricketer. This, this particular hand is a, of, of a famous cricketer. And uh, the other palm is an unknown palm and of, of a not so famous person or just an unknown person. So we'll just take a look and compare these particular hands. Just notice one thing out here that the this is the heart line out here compare this particular heart line with the heart line of the famous cricketer now this is the heart and this is plain and simple ending under the mount of saturn having a simple heart line is always better than a complicated kind of a heart line in a complicated kind of a heart line what happens is that you can't see this is not a singular kind of a line, but there are multiple kind of lines that are forming out here. You would notice that there's lots of confusion out here. It's made up of many, 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 many lines out here. So, and those lines are also kind of leaning a little bit downwards towards the base of the palm. This is the base of the palm. So, downward lines are always considered to be negative kind of lines now some people just might have imagine that some people might have a, these kind of a island like formations out here i'm just giving another aspect and it's this continuous island like formation is called a chain like formation you wouldn't find these chains something like this not they are not circular but they may be long kind of you won't find these kind of things but continuous islands out here could be meaning that it's a chain like formation this is basically a chain like formation so a chain like formation on this particular hand now the person may say that he is into deep trouble and he is the person might say that his life is hell and actually it might be hell i, I won't deny uh, about this uh, but at the same time sometimes what happens is that the line is is disturbed out here but in actual life if we take a look at the life is not so bad as it could have been in other people's case and the person uh, the stress and anxiety around him might not be as great as the person is is depicting see a problem is of subjective nature try to understand that some people uh, for them big problems they try to make them small and for other people even small problems basically affect them more compared to the other persons like for even a small problem might appear to be really big in this particular person's case now let's take the hand of this successful person successful cricketer so it's not that there's going to be no trouble in his life try to understand it doesn't mean even in spite of having the best hand it doesn't mean that there would be no trouble and no challenges and no uh, anxiety or all these same kind of things but at the same time this particular person manages stress and anxiety in a better way because the heart line is perfect so whatever big challenges or problems come in this particular person's life and the person might be facing huge challenges on a daily basis it's not that they're coming um, uh, less frequently they may be coming uh, like they may be uh, in his particular life on a daily basis but because the person's heart line is perfect and the other areas of the palm is also perfect the 
Mount of Venus is prominent, meaning that the person has got huge amount of energy levels, stamina, vitality. This area appears to be well padded. Even this particular area, well padded area of Venus basically signifies huge amount of energies and there are no bad indications. There are no crisscrossing lines out here. So automatically it would mean that the person is kind of only using his energies where it is required. It, the, this area is also not, not disturbed. This is the area of Mars. So this is the area of your fire. So the person is not misusing his fire. And the person who doesn't misuse his fire or fuel, this is the area of fuel, Venus, and this is the area of fire, the area of Mars. So it automatically means that the person likelihood of success increases and the area of Jupiter is also prominent, well padded. This, this means good administrative skills, political understanding of things. So the person is able to govern well. So all these things are, are there and a person has got this money triangle as well. Now we, we go back to the, the hand that is not so perfect. You would notice that in this particular hand, what is happening is the headline is also having a wave-like formation out here. So this is the earlier period before the age of 35. So the mental balance is going to be lost during this particular period and huge amount of mental agony and mental pain or depression is going to come to this particular person. And at the same time, you would also notice that the headline is something like this and the heart line is coming and joining the, the line of head out here. The heart line is joining the line of head out here. So again, it's, it's a negative sign. The, in the successful person's hand, you would notice that the line of head and the line of head and the line of heart are independent lines. So they should be independent from each other. They shouldn't be touching each other. And if they touch each other, it's not considered to be a good sign because the area in the middle is the area where the decisions are made. This is the area where uh, after huge deliberation, uh, the, the heart, the emotion part of the life and the head, the mental part of the life, they basically mingle in the middle and that's where the decisions are made. So what's going to happen is out here, the person's decisions are balanced kind of decisions. They are predictable kind of decisions. But in this particular person's case, the, the hand where we are, we are finding that the heart line is merging into the line of, uh, line of head, this is where complicated decisions are made. Like uh, the person wouldn't be able to reason things and uh, it is something like the uh, attachments, the affections are going to be a strain on his, this particular person's life and the expectations from our relationships are not going to be met. And that is the reason why disappointments are going to creep in. Apart from that, you would also notice that there's a girdle of Venus. Girdle of Venus is also a kind of comparatively negative kind of a line. See, if you are a photographer and if you are a fashion photographer, or if you are into some, uh, some, fantasies kind of a, if you're living in a fantasies world and that is your work, that's where this person can excel. But, but in a simple kind of a work in, in a, in a more, uh, work, which is more common. Like if you are an engineer, if you are a, a politician, if you are a lawyer, or if you are an accountant, these lines are not such a, such good line. If you are an actor, if you are an actress, it can be good, not necessarily 100%. You can't say that it is good, but in some cases, it might be excellent kind of indication. If you're a person, a person is a photographer, um, uh, the, it could be it, it could be really really good. And this is the uh, this line is basically the line of hysteria and uncontrolled emotions. So the emotions that come out are going to be hugely different from a normal person. So this person wouldn't have a consistent kind of a relationship. This person wouldn't have a stable kind of a relationship. And there, there are going to be problems for a long, long, long period in his life, maybe for, for the whole period of his life because the heart line is not so good. It's inconsistent. It is having these inconsistent branches and uh, 
the headline also is making a wave like formation out here so it's not a uh, predictable kind of a line so lines should be predictable they should go they should uh, have a predictable path like this or even if they move downwards it should be predictable it should be something like upward it should be uh, any anywhere it goes it's all okay but when there is like a wave like formation it is basically a bad indication it's a slight wave but even a slight wave is basically considered to be good i'm just going to draw a re again first the line is forming something like this then it changes its course it's kind of goes upward then it goes again downward so so this is where it's changing its course and it's changing its direction continuously it's not a predictable kind of a line so that is the reason why it is it is negative so you would see the, the comparison of both the hands one hand has got less lines over it the other hand has got more lines over it and more lines are out here specifically under the mount of saturn this is the area of mount of saturn on the headline so this may bring about depression and depressive tendencies so depressive tendencies and that too in the earlier period of one's life just imagine before the age of 35 if those things are happening uh, and so what effect is going to play out on this particular person's life so the person needs to be in good company now the last thing is that uh, this person also has got a okay okay kind of a supporting mars line so supporting mars line kind of protects this person so the person need not be very too much alarm but the person needs to be careful and uh, they should lead a very systematic kind of a life where uh, they they follow a regimented kind of a uh, lifestyle it's not like a wayward kind of a lifestyle where they uh, where they get up at any time and sleep at any time or eat at any time they should basically follow a very definitive part like they should get up early in the morning and sleep uh, sleep early eat right so all those things might improve this particular person's life so that's 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 all uh, i can uh, say out here so before i end this particular video i i do have something important to tell you people want to know about money possessions and wealth we can come to know about money from almost any line on your hand the heart line the head line the lifeline the sun line or any other mount as well importance of money line in terms of how much money we might make in our life is just 15% so don't think that money line tells you everything you notice that i showed the hand of a very successful person and uh, and uh, this person also uh, apart from having other good areas and mounts he also uh, like had less lines over it he also had a broken kind of a line so so in spite of all this thing the person should have good mounts simple lines simple heart line all these things bring success so that's what is a palm reading all about don't think that money line is the only line and all the sun line the line of name and fame and the line of uh, the line of uh, luck some people call it the line of luck i don't call it as the line of luck the line of sun so people say that that's the line of luck that's not so i just call it the line of how much energies you give to your work sunline is all about that a saint once said you do not need to go to a, an astrologer or a palmist to know about your future because you already know your future present is the result of past how will be my future future depends upon what you are doing in the present what are we we are product of our thoughts so the thoughts that come to our mind are really important keep positive thoughts and keep good company sometimes you are in the bad company and your hand shows all good aspects they might not apply because you are in the wrong company and you are going in the wrong direction and sometimes the hand has got all the errors all the wrong indications yet you would you would find that the person is doing good and the person is able to do good because the person is following the right path and being in the right company takes the person to the right direction so that's what uh, this video is all about 
before i end this video i would also request you to press the bell icon on youtube and don't miss another up update subscribe to my channel bye and take care